So here is the MI Journey course that we have set up for students who are incoming to the Marine Institute. Um, it'll help them um, learn how their Brightspace courses are going to work as well. It has the same sets of tools and features. I'm viewing this as a student. I could uh, make myself an instructor as well, but I want you to see what they see. I have access to lots of courses, so you'll see some updates here for me, but they would see updates that um, have been done to the course. Um, so we have a little picture here. Welcome as a first step, select course content and start reading through the content. Um, the course content is made up of a bunch of modules. Um, the first one would come up as this, but I've already been in here. So welcome to MI is the first one. And we have that and um, helping you learn online. And the one below it uh, is going to be open soon. So they are staggered opening. Students will see the module names down the left. And they won't see the content until it's revealed. Those dates are not set in stone. They may change as we go along. The students will be given information through social media that um, new things have happened and that they should go back into the Brightspace shell to see. <clears throat> so under Welcome to MI, we have these topic areas, these uh, subtopics, and the check marks at the end show that I've already been in that page as a student. I haven't been in the discussion board or self-assessment or frequently asked questions. So that doesn't have a tick mark. So from a student point of view here, it says you have seen eight of 11 topics and you're this much complete. So that will remind, serve as a reminder to help them go into each subtopic. So welcome to MI is our first one. And that has a little quick video. I'm going to let that play through. Then I'm going to pop in and out of each uh, sub module. everyone and welcome to MI Journey, the start of your voyage as a Marine Institute student. My name is Dr. Angie Clark and I'm the Director of Academic and Student Affairs at MI. We have developed this space for you to learn everything you need to know about being successful at MI. From making key contacts, sharpening your math skills, to getting to know your classmates and everything in between. Everything you need to know about being an MI student is right here in MI Journey. Most importantly, by navigating this space, you'll also be learning about how your online courses will be delivered this fall. All of your course content will be in shells, just like this one. So dive in, get to know what it is that makes MI such a special place to be. And as always, ask questions. If you are unsure of anything, need some assistance, or just need to talk to someone about your transition to MI, we're all here to help you. Welcome to your MI journey. So a welcome video. Then the next one as well has a video and I'll play this one through as well because it has uh, a bit of everything and the school head speaking as well. We are excited to launch Marine Institute's commitments for the fall semester. Remote delivery in the fall will make for a different type of semester for new and returning students, but MI is committed to providing a great learning experience. Remote and online learning is new for many students, but the faculty and staff at MI are leaders in online delivery. In the fall 2020 semester, we are committed to provide clear expectations for all students in the remote delivery of all programs. Significant work has gone into preparing courses for the fall semester, and we know that students will continue to have questions. We are committed to being transparent in our communication and responsive to student feedback. Connection to your faculty and peers is an important component of the student experience at the Fisheries and Marine Institute. We are committed to developing the strong sense of community that we are proud of at MI. Fostering our students' connection to their program of study is important. Our program chairs and our faculty in our programs are leaders in their fields and will be engaged in the fall semester. We are committed to high levels of student support across all areas and levels of study. We have set these important goals to ensure we implement creative and innovative programming to support you, our students, for the fall semester.
Okay, so that was your second video. If we come out again here to the Welcome to MI module, we have a land acknowledgement message. Uh, Glenn has a lovely little quick welcome message. The MISU Student Union. Meet Your Journey Guide. This is Rhonda McMeekin will be um, the lead in taking care of the students and directing their questions and answering their questions. Um, then after that, we have a discussion board, a bunch of boards, I should say, social media information, great pictures sprinkled throughout this site, <coughs> and a self-assessment, a quiz so we can see where they are and what their concerns are. So that's module one, and that's open to them now. And, oh yeah, campus maps. So that's your module one. Oh, that's your welcome, sorry. This is your module one, helping you learn online. So this has four four topics. Learning online at, at Marine Institute. As Rob Shea had said, uh, we have been leaders in this um, for a long time before most of these students were born. And uh, that is one of the concerns that a lot of students have. So this tells them what that will be like how to manage their time and their study skills. So that's what's under here in the first module. And then your student supports and services. Under here we have our international student support. Um, let me just go back as me as not a student. already so international student support I have some good pictures here of uh, interns I assume and it says meet Sonia she can help you what she does how to find her what um, MI International is all about and then that continues on talks about some opportunities Satria, cross-cultural training, anti-racism, and then links out to the MI International Office. So that is visible to them right now. So that's what's under number two here. This is student supports and services. Then number three, your academic supports. Talks about how these things are going to work this year with their math readiness and online learning and the writing center. It will be online through MS Teams. Then your student experience. This talks about wellness and um, how to get help for mental issues, student code of content, uh, conduct. The campus store that involves both books and um, gift store items get involved. This is a recreation of fitness led by Rose Hatfield. She has some great little videos there. So that's your student experience, your money, managing your money, plus how to apply for scholarships. And this one, for instance, is still being written. Um, Rhonda McMeekin is tagged to it, as you can tell, and then it's not visible. Yes, so they wouldn't see that. Again, the whole module is um, invisible until July 20th, but they'll see down the side that it's coming. Then explore your program. This goes into each program. So they'll meet the faculty and the program chairs, and each program chair will be doing a video of each program. So that should be interesting. Some of them are done, some are coming soon. But again, this is not going to be visible until July 20th, so that's okay. And um, welcome from the senior students, which is important. And your lab safety course and WIMIS. They have to have those done before we see them face to face in the labs. And then ready, set, go. This is going to be the sort of stuff that we would have done with them in September. And that's yet to be filled out because it's in the future. So that, that's your main module. So there's six main modules plus a beginning and then an ending right here. So that's it. All of the 
um, sub topics were left here to just show them that every online course will have these core uh, features just to make them feel more comfortable and more familiar. They'll be encouraged to put their little picture up there with their name and to explore all the functions just to uh, decrease the intimidation and make them feel more welcome. That's it in a nutshell.